right, guys, welcome back to another episode of Medieval Dynasty. Now, I can't remember if it's turning day or night. So it looks like we're turning, I would say, day. So must have slept um, last night. We still have to go up to that mine to see if we got that bear at all or not. So I wanted to do that today, but um, I got some food on us and... I'm just going to actually stock up our food storage because I started using some of the food from here. So I wanted to get at least a couple more of these filled up. Uh, just so it's easy access for when we need it. It's like 20, I think, per thing. That usually does a full food bar. And we've got the spear. We don't really need that on us anymore. There's no more bears up there, as far as I know. Um, what else did I want to do today? I wanted to... Well, we can go get some more minerals. Um, we'll be up at the mine anyways, so... Shouldn't be that hard to do. I think we need the knife still. And we'll probably keep the bow because I don't know if there's another bear around there or not. So we'll keep the bow on us just, just for good measure. Uh, we do need pickaxes though. I'm not sure if I have... Yeah, I have some in here. So these ones are at 100%, so we'll be able to use those. We have that 60% one. And I think that's all we really need. Outside of a basket, we'll grab one from the storage shed and we'll stock up on water uh, Summer's just around the corner as well, so it'll be probably happening in Today's episode for sure. All right, so we'll have the um, The rye or I think it's actually oats rise during the winter, right? So we'll have that to harvest <clears throat> We'll have the carrots the Eats and the cabbage on either side. All right, so let's head up the hill and then we can go ahead and start working on um, trying to locate that bear if I remember if I actually chopped it up or not. I can't remember if I did or not, so uh, we'll have to try locating it. I can't remember exactly where it landed either, so we'll have to figure that out. But, um, it's just, it's up there somewhere. I, I don't think I remember chopping it up, so we'll go up there, grab that, get some meat.
All right, so I've actually discovered that carrying the rocks and stuff like this is generally the easiest way. <clears throat> However, it might be better if we were to offload some of the stuff into here. Uh, let's just change the view. Uh, we might be able to just keep the rocks in. And, you know, if we had some leather, that would probably be really easy to manage. Uh, the reason why... Whoop. Ah, darn it. Uh, the reason why I'm um, keeping the stone is we can use it for flower pots and other things. So... And also new buildings and stuff like that, too. Ah... It's really hard to actually keep stuff in. I wish you could just pick up the stack and move it. But I, I understand why they don't do that, because then you could carry a lot of stuff. But maybe there's some condition that they can make that... Like, for example, if you are... Um, uh, well, maybe if you could pick it up, but you can't move. Um... That would allow you not to really travel too far, but allow you to still move things into baskets and stuff. I think that would be a reasonable um, kind of a outcome for allowing people to still move stacks of items and stuff. Because in certain times, like the rocks and stuff, it's really hard to... You, you want to throw it down, but you also don't want to like it up again and try dropping it so maybe having that as a compromise would allow people to still move stacks of items but um, only within where they're standing I think that might be actually a pretty good idea uh, you know I, I do uh, M creator tutorials and stuff like that for Minecraft it's M creator is like a um, mod making thing from Minecraft uh, software. So I, I have a lot of logic uh, behind me of kind of figuring out stuff. And recently I've been working with uh, one of my mods in that particular thing uh, for CCTV craft, which is adding drones. So that's just kind of one of the things that I was thinking about because you can actually, uh, I've been working with velocity for the drone and stuff like that. So I think that would actually probably work as long as they were bound and if they were even to
right, a, some sudden and very strong storm has passed through your village during the night and damaged some of your buildings. Thankfully, no one was hurt. So we'll have some repairs that we need to do. There's four buildings that have been damaged, so we'll have to go try to figure out which ones um, got damaged. But um, looks like ours is fine. That one's a little bit damaged. I'll have to fix that. Um, that one over there. The well is a little bit damaged. We'll see if we can't find the other one. Uh, we'll need to get our hammers. And then we'll have to see if we can't find the resources for fixing those up. So, uh, prefer prefer preferably better than... Or sooner than better, or something like that. <laughs> so we got, ooh, quite a bit of damage on this one. So we need four stones. I'm glad we went mining, actually, then. Uh, I'm not sure where the fourth place is damaged. Doesn't look like any of these buildings. But we should still have some of this that we can utilize. We have, like, 300. Uh, we'll drop about 88, just so we have the resources on us. And we'll start repairing some of these structures. So, oh! Whoops, sorry, dude. So we'll need to repair this one. And that. Okay, we're gonna need a few logs as well. And yeah, we're gonna need. Quite a bit of resources, I think. A few planks. At least for this house. We'll have to finish the houses first. Just to make sure that they're, you know, strong enough for the residents. Um, I'm going to put the, the stone down here for now. Oh, we only have two on this. That's not too bad. We'll go ahead and get some wood and we'll make up some planks and stuff we don't have extra already uh, it does not look like we have extra planks so I'll grab what we got for wood grab about 10 and we'll start repairing some of these buildings um, that roof probably needs repair for thatch for that that's not too bad Okay, so we're going to need how many? Three.
Alright guys, so I got quite a bit of stuff done today. Uh, we apparently chopped up the bear um, that we had before. Um, I, I thought I might have not done that, but um, apparently we have. So uh, it's now autumn. Uh, as you can see, so we fixed all the buildings up um, They're not damaged anymore from the windstorm. I got the fertilizer ready for next episode So we'll till that up and then we'll be ready for uh, spring as well, and then we have um, Work to do on this field still. There's a whole bunch of oats that needs to be um, Harvested uh, we'll see if we can't get a better sickle uh, unlocked. I'm not sure if we have it unlocked yet or not It might be bronze that we'll be able to use uh, I know there's an iron one that has like a hand thing uh, that does a way better range It's way easier to use and stuff like that than the the ones that we've been using So we'll see if we can't make one of those up for us and uh, get that field uh, all cleared out but uh outside of that if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and i will see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out